<laughs> Hello, double O crew. Welcome to Obsession Outdoors. We haven't done an actual video in forever. We're here at the gunpowder. Awesome wild trout area here. We got the we got TRK. Oh, we got the homie Romy. <laughs> and I bet you if you look over this bridge right here, might even see some fish real quick. And we got a scruffy tuffy here. It's not looking so hot on my face he right needs now. Shave. But that's something to look forward to because I'm specifically scruffy for a music video that I'm working on. So that'll be out soon. Look out for that. Also, any of you who might not have seen yet, I uh, deleted Instagram, so that's no longer a thing. Uh, switched over to Facebook. It's just much more convenient and everything's all in one place. Family, friends, y'all. So bounce over to Facebook. I'll leave the link to the Facebook in the either comments or description or somewhere. Or you could just type in my name, Steven Johnson. Anyway, we're going to get down to this stream. See if we can catch any fish. I won't be fishing today because I haven't renewed my license yet and it's expired. Uh, Alec and TRK are going to be doing all the fishing and I'm going to be filming. I want to fish so bad though. This this run right here looks amazing. Oh, let's see what they can catch. Son of a beach as it is. Son of a beach. You see where it just starts to swirl? Yeah. Cast there and let your line drift Ripped on the down. edge of the fast water. Yep. Because if you cast down here, you're going to get stuck in a tree like we did six times and break off. I see the tree that comes out. <laughs> Yo, it's blank and red. It's blank and red. We're using artificial night crawlers. You can get them from Walmart in the little packs. They look just like real night crawlers. They look They're exactly. In those small you can get at Walmart, yeah. and they come in the scent boxes. Right. They they look identical to a real night crawler, like a little chunk of one pinched off. I th they're even called like pinched crawler or something, yeah. right? Fish on, fish on. Let's go! Alright, let's see what the first catch of the day is. A rock. It's a rock. How the heck did you catch a rock? My man caught a rockfish out here. Do you smell what the rock is cooking? Any other rock jokes? No? Let's rock and roll. That last one was rock salad, you're right. <laughs> hey Michael, where are you going? Well, looks like the fishing ain't hot right now. Let's go interview the dummy gooch. What's up, dummy gooch? What's up? It's time for your daily interview. Now, I just got a couple questions. Firstly, what did you mean when you said it was blinking red? It's blinking red. I just want to know. Sir, sir, you cannot walk out of this interview. Sir. Okay, sir, second question of your interview. What exactly is a dummy gooch? I'd like to know, please. You're sir, the one, you're the one that made that sir, why are you walking out of the interview for the second time? We've already went over this. Sir, sir, he's got a stick. Run. Okay, dokie, boss. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch your back swing there, Junior. I just want to comment here, though. For the last two weeks straight, all I've heard about is how amazing this spot was. Uh, I'm not going to say any names or anything. I'm not going not gonna to say who was talking this spot up so much. Uh, me and Glennie wanted to fish for crappy and perch today, but hey, somebody said this spot was amazing. Stand. Listen to what the stream's telling me. I'm glad we didn't listen to the stream, baby. I'm glad we didn't listen to the stream. We should have listened to the stream. First you catch a rockfish, then you catch a stickfish. Glenno, Alex said we should move and listen to the stream. And right as he says it, guess what happens? What? What? Oh, help you out. I was trying to get Glenny stick fish on camera. The people want to see this. I'm going to walk down to the next spot because that's where they're going to end up anyway. And I'm going to regret it if they catch a fish there. But I saw the way that water looked. And it's real skinny. It doesn't look like a hot spot to me. Now this on the other hand. Ooh. This looks like money. 
Whew. If we don't catch a fish on the other side of this tree right here, we ain't catching a fish today. Interview question number three. Oh. What exactly do you think you're doing right now, Michael? What, what are you trying to do? Are you trying to make your mother seriously upset with you when you inevitably fall in this water and get muddy? What are you, you doing? You think I'll fall? What are you thinking right now? Tell the camera what you're thinking, please. I think I'll accomplish the goal. I just gotta... Well, mama, here, here, here goes nothing. Let's see what he does. He's going in. He What did I tell you? Okay. What did I, I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> <I don't. laughs> ah, your mom was gonna kill you. I didn't give it. Your mom was gonna <laughs> kill you. <laughs> At least you can see fish here. So you know as long as you present it for long enough, you'll do that. All right, net. We, we need to net. These are wild fish. We gotta take care of them. Damn, look at the big one. <gasps> Glenny, follow up cast, quick. Oh my God, Glenny, that's a giant brown. Glenny. Glenny! Okay, okay. There's a giant brown, guys. I don't know if you can see that. How you doing? He's got one on, but there's a really big one chasing the one he has on. So he's trying to let it sit so he can get his bait in and do a follow-up cast. All right, guys. Wild brown. I'm gonna lip him so I don't touch his. Not too pretty. You you have wet hands. I don't have wet hands. So I'm gonna lip him. That way I don't mess his slime coating up. See ya, buddy. Beautiful colors. No, these are wild. Wild brown wild brown trout. Yeah, you can't keep these. This is a catch and release area only. That was that was probably a 17 inch brown. The one that followed him. Oh my god, that thing was nice. A wild gunpowder brown. That was nice. Thankfully you have a longer rod than I do, so you can. Now would be the wrong time to hook one to one. Now it's precisely when he's going to. Hold this. Yep. I was going to, but Steven's got the big one. Why are you always doing that to me? I didn't try. It's still your fish. All I did was pick it up. All right. It's not the biggest one, but it's a nice one. That is a nice wild brown. Is it? I can't see it from clear from this way. Net him, net him, net him, net him, net him. Well, that was a weird way of that happening, but nice. <laughs> All right. Uh, I was trying not to hold the rod because technically I don't have my license. Like I said, I'm not supposed to be. I was just trying to untangle it for him and there happened to be a fish on it. Super quick, less than I'd say a minute and a half or so, we got that fish undone very carefully. And here he is. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous brown. I've only held him like this by the lip, making sure to not touch his sides. He did get attacked by something that you can see here on both sides. He's like scraped up. Got them super sharp teeth. I'll get my feet a little wet here to give you guys an underwater shot. Well, here's the audio test guys for the GoPro Hero 11 I have no clue what it sounds like right now because it was just underwater so I guess you'll know right now because you're hearing it and I'll know when I edit this video hopefully you can hear me here's what awesome. I'm fishing with guys super realistic Alec caught his on the like maggot waxworm basically imitation. a waxworm jig and Glenny has the had the little pinched crawler or whatever they're called Freaking awesome. Heck yes. All right, guys, we weren't filming anymore, but at the end of the day here, Alec has caught a oh, wild look Maryland fence. rainbow. Look at the white on his fence. Bro, oh look at the God. white on his fence. Let's go, baby. Wild Maryland rainbow. Look at that. 
the pec fins, the white tips. Perfect. You don't get that from the stockies. Oh, baby. Wow, the rainbow. You gotta take this so I can not fall, please. Gotcha. I'm on the. Sorry. Dang, I can't even put this camera on Alex's hat. Oh, he's a fighter. This is what we're doing, guys, out here just fish fighter, after fish baby. after fish. You just gotta find the hole. That's it. Once you find the hole in this spot, you got him. Beautiful dry. wild brown. Look at the colors. The red on the fins. Even the oh, back right fin. The top fin, yeah. Top fin, back fin. You got the white lines on the uh, peck fins there. These wild fish are so beautiful. Gorgeous. See ya. We set a goal and we achieved it. Same thing we always do here. That's gonna wrap it up for this video. We're gonna keep fishing like we always do. And that'll be that. So until next time, get out there and enjoy the outdoors. Be brave, stay wild. Peace. <laughs>